Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Tyler from Podcast Now. This is Podcast Now Eats. I'm wearing one of our uh, merchandise that we have on CoraMerch.com. Stand up real quick. Here we go. Uh, we actually have Podcast Now apparel also, as well as Podcast Now Eats and Tyler's Kitchen and Cooking with Alex apparel as well. So check that out if you're a fan of the series. So today, the main event that we're reviewing is the Quest um, Pumpkin Pie? Yes, Pumpkin Pie Quest Bar. Now you might be saying, Tyler, you said you would never, ever eat a Quest Bar again. And you're right, I did say that, and it was, I, I was like, dare I even said it to Alex, I was like, dare I even get this? But I feel like it'll be a disaster, so that's why I did. So, then I saw that, uh, for those of you who know the, the uh, VPX brand, they make Bang. Uh, so they came out with these Zero Impact bars. Seems nice-ish, kind of kind of odd in the packaging, how I, how I feel the bar under it. Uh, Legendary Pumpkin Supreme. The only reason I bought that, I was interested, but I kind of wanted to compare, you know, what, you know, the difference between how Quest does their pumpkin and how Zero Impact or, or VPX does theirs. And I am a big, huge pumpkin pie, pumpkin spice fan. Um, I, I have I have serious problems, but we're also going to do so. There's like a two part to this episode. We're also going to review the brand new Lenny and Larry's. They're like crunchy. It says the complete crunchy cookies. Very awesome. Uh, so we're going to try those out. We already opened them, and I'm like, you know what? These are so new. Let's do a little review. So we got those. That'll be next. So we're going to start with the Quest pumpkin pie bar. So here we go, we're gonna open it up. My first impression is it smells like chocolate. It smells like chocolate, so that, you know, obviously can't be that great. So I'm just gonna break a little piece off. Seems, okay, so that's the inside. Can we see that? This camera's hard to work, got it. Okay, so that's the inside, so, I mean, it. I, it literally is like chocolate. So here we go. Ready? Are we ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Oh, wow, there's a crunch to it. There's literally... Where's this crunch coming from? There is no... You can even say what you think. Um, I taste nothing. I, I literally, I'm not kidding. I taste absolutely nothing. Amazing. Quest managed to do it again. They, they made a horrible product last time. This time they make something that is, I mean, what is it? It's almost vanilla-y. I don't even taste that. But barely. So, mm -mm. we're gonna heat that up, but now we're gonna try this one. I mean, that's pumpkin pie. Amazing. And look at how different this one is. So from VPX, Zero Impact, Legendary Pumpkin Supreme. Look at that, how fun. How fun is that? Here we go. Now, right off the bat, as you can see, I have not smelled it yet. I smell the pumpkin from here. Yeah, that's, that's, it's an odd, it's almost like, There's like pieces, I guess. It, it reminds me of, I'm, I was outside for a little bit too long and I start smelling, hold on. I start smelling like outside. So that's that here, focus. Okay, so, that, I mean they look almost, they almost look the exact same. Oh, it's disgusting. It's not good? No. All right, so her first reaction is it's not good, so. Here we go. I feel like I swallowed a tablespoon of nutmeg. Oh. Oh, it's getting worse. Oh boy. Hey, holy crap. Hang on to your seats, folks. Whoa. I mean, it, it, like, it literally, there's nothing. It's like a silent killer. It's like coming up and it's like, pop! She's right, it's like nutmeg and only nutmeg. But it literally, like, 
What do these... Oh my god. I'm gonna go heat those up, so give me one second. Stay ready. What the heck? Clearly these companies can't handle pumpkin. When? You can see me? Yes. Okay, so they are done. They like cooked or something. They're like bigger, falling apart. So here we go. Zero impact, a little hot. Oh my God. You wanna try it? No. Like, and you're probably like, why do you keep eating it? Because I can't believe how bad it is. Um, wow. That that got worse, which is unbelievable that that's possible. So here we go with the quest that I'm rolling off of the plate. Here we go. No. It, it, it got like sour. Or sour. So, mm, I love I love when the frosting that's protein made gets sour. Delicious. Um, I'm just gonna finish this off because for that one I'm not. Well, that was disgusting. So, I mean, as a as a pumpkin spice fan. Um, someone who loves the Lenny and Larry pumpkin spice or uh, pumpkin cookie, I I don't understand. Like they're able to do it. Quest, you would think, Quest, and and the one bar, they they have a fantastic pumpkin spice bar. Quest, garbage. I mean, it was it had no flavor normal, which is most people would have like on the go. They would have a Quest bar. They don't have a microwave in their car. But then if you do have a microwave, it turns it sour. It tasted like, there was like a soury taste. Zero impact, horrible, both regular and, I mean it was it was just plain nutmeg. Then it got like, like I don't even know. Like, does this, I just wanna know. When you, when you see this picture, got it? When you see this picture, do you think it's gonna become this? I don't think so. I was hoping for an amazing. I mean, it said it said supreme. They lie. Anyways, they don't even deserve a score. Horrible. Don't buy them. Totally garbage. And you might be wondering, well, Tyler, are you done buying Quest? I am. But then there's Rocket. The word on the street for Quest is that they're coming out with a gingerbread cookie and possibly a um, peppermint bark bark. Will I try those? Unfortunately, I probably will because I, I just, it's almost, it, it, it blows my mind how you continuously put something out that's horrible, yet people buy them. I, I don't get it. So now to the company who actually makes good things. Uh, the Crunchy Lenny and Larry cookies. Now we're gonna, I'm gonna review both. Um, I actually need this plate. Nah, I, I'm not. So here we go. So we're gonna start with chocolate chip. Uh, and I've only had a few of these, so. so here we go. So it's a reseal of the bag. There's the inside. We've had a lot more than a few. Well, somebody's had a lot more than a few. I've had one a day, maybe two. So here we go. I already did that. So, ready? So it's certainly, they're crunchy. And they are good. They're very different than the regular Lenny and Larry cookie. Um, but I like them. I like them a lot. And it's definitely something like, if I had kids, instead of getting them like Chips Ahoy, I, I'd probably opt to buy something like this. No egg, no dairy, uh, plant-based protein. There's six grams of protein in six cookies, nine grams of sugar, not that bad. Uh, 160 calories. Really it. I mean, it's not, they're not that horrible. Um, so here's the cinnamon sugar. I believe that's what it's like. Yeah, cinnamon sugar. I thought it was Snickerdoodle when I bought them. I, the other one, Snickerdoodle, the regular one. But so here we go. 
Well, that's really crunchy. Did you, you try one? Mm -hmm. I don't think these have as much flavor. But they taste like sugar cookies. They're sweeter than the chocolate chip cookie. They... They don't, um, they are, they are slightly sweeter, but I don't know if I would call them cinnamon or cinnamon sugar. Uh, uh no, they are a little bit cinnamon sugary. They're just not, not as, uh, it's not as cinnamon sugary as you would expect from like a regular cookie. They are good. They are crunchy. Um, uh, you get quite a few in the back too. I mean, they do sell smaller, like single serve bag, not single serve, but like the little things that you put in like lunch. Um, I do prefer, however, the chocolate chip version over the cinnamon, um, cinnamon sugar version. Now there is also a double chocolate version and it's in red. Um, so I do really like these. Uh, and I, I'm almost in like a mood because of these stupid uh, quests. I don't even know how to even review these. So I'm basically just gonna say, these are really good. Um, they're definitely something to try, for sure. Like, if you like Lenny and Larry cookies, they're definitely something to try. If you have kids that tend to like to bring cookies or you like to put cookies in their lunch, I would, they're, they're at a uh, vitamin shop. I don't know where else, but I know they're available at the vitamin shop. Um, so go, go, you know, to your local vitamin shop. They're gonna have them. Um, try them out. There's no way, I, I highly doubt. I mean, if your kid doesn't like super crunchy cookies, they might not like them. Flavor-wise, though, I mean, you, you literally, it's no different than Chips Ahoy or any of those type of brands. Uh, and they're probably a little bit better for you also when you, when you like, read what's in it, not GMO, vegan, all that stuff. So, uh, definitely really like these. Go try these out. Absolutely stay away from anything Quest, Pumpkin Pie, don't. And especially don't get the Zero Impact um, Legendary Pumpkin Supreme. That's horrible. They're disgusting. So that is our episode for today. That's Podcast Now Eats. Please check out our other content, um, our other previous Podcast Now Eats episodes. And thank you guys for watching.